come home to having your heater blow cold air, it can seem like the strangest thing, and something's definitely wrong with the heating system. But actually, it could be a good sign. It could be a sign that your heating system is working as it should and protecting the compressor or the heat exchanger. And there's some easy DIY fixes that you could do to try to get it working again. So the easiest thing and the first thing that you should check is the filter. After you shut off the heater, go ahead and check where your return air grill is, where you change your filters, and you want to see a, a relatively clean filter. If you see it pretty dirty, it's caked with dirt, it's definitely a good idea to change that filter out. It seems so silly, but a dirty filter can really restrict the airflow and it can restrict it enough to freeze your coils and that would lower the airflow and then put your heater in defrost mode and that actually blows cold air instead of warm air in the winter season. Easy fix, just try, check your filters, change them out and if that doesn't work then it's probably a mechanical or an electrical failure. Other reasons you could have a heater blowing cold air if you have a gas furnace, you want to check that the pilot light hasn't gone out if it's an older gas furnace that you have. And another restriction can be in the filter dryer, and that protects the compressor from debris. And if that filter dryer gets clogged, then your system could also freeze up and blow that cold air. It could also be from the evaporator coils got dirty, and that would cause a low airflow restriction. Other reasons why your heater could be blowing cold air is that it could be wiring or control board related. You could have low refrigerant in the system or the actual blower speed may be set too low and again it would cause not enough airflow to go over the coils. So if you notice ice over the coils on the outside unit or the home isn't heating up to what your thermostat's set to or cold air blowing out 